Hey everyone, it's Michelle Rojas. Today I went over to Kristen McGuire's house for a special live watch and Q&A for the dub of Citrus. Kristen is the ADR director for this title and she invited me and some other actors to do this stream with her. We got some good questions today and it really got me thinking about how people are kind of viewing this title. I think a lot of times when we get media that focuses on underrepresented groups, we set our expectations higher than we normally would. We want them to be this be-all, end-all thing thing instead of just allowing it to be an average show. It puts a lot of pressure on the creative team that's working on it. I'm sure part of that comes from the need for these shows to succeed and do well enough. You don't want these shows to run into a situation where they have low numbers and then someone easily goes, oh, it's because of the LGBT content. But I feel like there's a sense of freedom and comfort in being able to just go, well, that was a cute show. The reactions to Citrus has really made me think about how difficult it is for creators to create gay content because of that pressure for it to be something so spectacular. It's sort of like if it doesn't meet this embellished expectation that it's not good representation. And personally, I just don't feel like that should be the case. You can have good representation in shows, games, books, whatever, and still have problems with the pacing, the art, maybe the story just wasn't that interesting. And I'm not advocating for anyone to shoot for mediocrity, but I would like to encourage anybody that wants to make stories about underrepresented groups to just go for it. So while I do think Citrus at this point does look good and interesting, if it ends up losing its way, I'll still be happy that it was made. Because what's really important is that we have some realistic, honest representation in media. Well, that's it for me today. So as always, thank you for watching and see you tomorrow.